matters the most. It feels amazing. I think we came out wanting it more, and we just came out super strong, and our effort was amazing that whole game. What did you change up, you know, from last week's regional championship to this one? I think today our team talked so well, and we just knew that we had to move as a team and do everything together as a team. Yeah, you, you went in 1-1 one, one at the break. What, what did you change up at halftime? Uh, at half, it was tie game, and we knew that we had to come out and win it more, and we came out full pressure, every, pushing everything at them we could. You've seen this Gillette team so many times, so were you expecting anything different, or could you try anything different, or what? We were expecting all the physicality, but their midfield just pa strings together passes so well, so we knew we had to stick together in the middle. You know, over the years, this East Conference has just been so dominant. Year after year, you keep sweeping the West. I mean, what is it that makes the whole East Conference so tough? I think the East Conference just practices so hard, and playing against all the other teams just makes us a lot better. It did matter the most. You know, I think last week just not having Morgan and goal was really tough for the kids mentally. Just having her back there leading and communicating and organizing was just such a big factor for us today. Um, and I'm just so proud of the girls for finding their win um, after five years. Did you change up anything at halftime going inside? You know, it came down to the mental side of things. We were getting bullied a little bit in our head. I told them to calm down, relax. It's going to be okay. Just play our game. And we took it to them in the second half. Uh, you know, this year after year, this whole East Conference just been so tough. To me. What what is it that that you know you, you can almost always count on an East team to win the state, I mean, especially with, with what you've seen? Yeah, you know, there's a lot of good soccer coming through the pipeline. The youth development programs in these cities are really strong, and so I think that says a lot about the years to come behind these classes that we have right now. This year, you know, this season, you, know, you had a good chunk of your home games way in the first half of the season. Uh, then you hit the road. Uh, then you had and you had a few problems kind of adjusting yeah. stuff tripped up a few bit there So what was kind of going on there and how'd you adjust? You know, I think it's called effort um, I think we thought since we won all those games in the beginning of the year We could just show up and not have um, a lot of pace to our game And so we had to talk about some things and say listen We're gonna win these games based on our effort and our tenacity and our aggressiveness and we did just that in the second part of the season